Hey guys, and welcome to July Monthly Favourites. I've got for you a little surprise because for a change this time around, there are going to be some gadgets, some fashion, and the usual beauty and makeup. So let's get started. A first this month is the Invisibubble. And the great thing about it, it doesn't leave a kink in your hair. But for me, what is more important, because of the less pressure due to the design, like a wiry, sort of like a phone cord design, it doesn't like pull so much on your hair. So when you um, have a ponytail, it just isn't as tight. It, does, it feels secure, but it doesn't feel like it's pulling so much, so you're not getting headaches. But also, you'll find it's really easy to remove. All you need to do is grab one string and just pull. And again, because of the design, it comes off really nicely and easily without pulling your hair. So I've been using this now since February and I can definitely see my hair is nice, smooth and there's no broken hair anywhere somewhere mid length where I normally put my, um, my like hair bund. So I've been loving this and I initially thought it's a massive gimmick and it's not going to be anything super cool. So I had to eat my own words on that product. Second gadget this month is the Clarisonic cleansing device. I had it for about a year and a half, near two years now, and I haven't been really using it properly. By saying properly, I mean every day, that's how it was designed to be used. And mainly because I was finding my skin getting a little bit dry if I use this product daily. Now I've done a lot of research, a lot of reading on the internet, and I managed to speak to people actually from Clarisonic itself. So after understanding how it works, I gave it another go. And I've been using it now every single day in the morning and evening for nearly two months. And my skin is just amazing. I'm loving it. I, I can't imagine not using it. So if you want to know more, make sure you are subscribed because I will be doing a whole video about Clarisonic cleansing device, how it works, what to use it with, what you need to know, anything, anything to make sure that you're getting the most of. But I've been absolutely loving it and um, it's been great to learn how to use it and also to get the most of having this great device being able to use products on my skin that I wasn't able to use before and just feeling that I know and knowing that my skin is super super clean. And so a little bit of a skincare this month is the Clarins Hydro Quench Tint and Moisturizer. I've been absolutely loving it. It's such a nice and lightweight texture that it blends into the skin really quickly. It leaves your skin looking a little bit glowy, just a little bit perfected very nice and lightweight texture so you can wear it and just keep your skin bare and because the weather was so hot it was just really nice to feel like my skin is perfected and also like I don't need to put makeup to to keep my skin looking good so I've been literally wearing it every single day over June and July and I thought I love it so much I wear it even if I use foundation on top so it really deserved to get into my top products this month. You will find also that it keeps your skin really, really hydrated through the whole day. It's been amazing and I love the smell of it. So my next product is a lip liner from Charlotte Tilbury. And this is um, the Lip Cheat Lip Liner in Pillow Talk, which is a very sort of soft, natural, pinky nudie shade. And it's perfect to get your lips to look really perfected and you can then apply any lipstick or lip gloss you want and get that natural but pretty lip look. So I think this is one of those products that's a must have in pretty much any makeup bag. It's about £16 and you can get it at Selfridges. I hugely recommend you have a look at this. And the exciting part this month, a little bit of fashion. So because the weather was so so good this month, I've been literally most of the time in my back garden, in my bikini. And that was partly because I treated myself to a really lovely bikini and it's from um, Melissa Odebash. 
It's really nice. It's got Miami splash and it's really colorful and will look really nice with tan skin, not a pale like mine. And I treated myself to this bikini because we were meant to go on a nice little holiday to Italy this year, but we had to change our plans. So I decided to rock the look in the back garden. And the weather was quite good, so I could do that. And I just feel it's it's just a really nice bikini. Um, I haven't treated myself to one for ages, so I felt like I can splash out. And I decided to go to a Melissa Alderbash store and pick this one up. But I warned you, they have amazing Maxa dresses as well. So if you love your summer holidays or if you um going away, look this way. Some really cool stuff in there. And that's it. That was my other favourite because I literally spend a lot of time wearing it. Along with my one piece summer jumpsuit, which is what I'm wearing now. Woo! Um, and it has become pretty much my work uniform as well anytime I'm sitting down and writing blogs. But also perfect summer garden chill out to wear. However, this month the weather was rather good. So I invested in this little short piece from uh, One Piece as well. And it was only 20 quid on the sale. And it's all made from really nice cozy cotton. So I've been loving this. So that was two things I was mainly wearing every single day. The short piece and, um, and my bikini. And in the evening I was jumping back into my, my One Piece jumpsuit to feel cozy and comfy. I hope you enjoy that and uh, it was nice to see some other things except just makeup. If you like that extra touch, let me know and maybe you give me a thumbs up so I know you like that and I will think of perhaps adding some more of my gadgety, fashion-y sort of items into the mix. And take care, thanks for watching and I see you in the next video.